Hello equestrians and welcome to Scotland. My name is Alyssa and I am on a quest to ride every breed. There are hundreds of different horse breeds and each one has their own unique story. So saddle up and join me on a ride to discover the horse. We're gonna be filming the four native Scottish breeds and today you're gonna to meet the Eriskay Pony. I'm meeting up with Ruth. She's a lifelong equestrian and secretary of the Eriskay Pony Society. This is how she got started with the breed. I'd, I'd known about them since I was a child. I think there was a, a, an article in a newspaper that I remember my mum saying, oh, that's interesting. People out in the Western Isles have, have um, found a rare breed of pony and, and they're saving it under called Eriskay Ponies. And that kind of stayed in my head because as a child I was keen on ponies and had um, a little Welsh mountain pony and then a Balshy Highland and what have you. Um, so, so at the back of my mind I thought, gosh, there is this other rare Scottish breed that no one ever talks about, um, but if they're still rare and they're still trying to pr preserve them, um, maybe I can give one a, a home. So when I lost the companion of, of my big riding horse, I thought, well, maybe I can give a home to one of these Eriski ponies and that might help. So yes, a small, cheeky, dark, dark roan sort of creature appeared and uh, proceeded to run circles around my big old thoroughbred and pinch his food out of his bucket and everything. Um, and then when, when the thoroughbred um, unfortunately developed arthritis, I thought, hmm, um, I, I better do something with this pony or I'll have nothing to ride. So I um, got him backed and started and I've just found I had this most amazing pony that I was riding that actually didn't feel hugely different to a 16-hand thoroughbred just because they, they do stride out so nicely and do go forward really well. So I just kept riding him and the other horse became the companion. That was it. Now Ruth has several Eriske ponies, including a young mare named Enya, who will be my quest horse for the breed. This is the oddest um, token for a saddle you'll have ever I seen. I was just going to ask you about this. It's called a total contact system, invented by a rather eccentric Englishman, I think. It is essentially, you know, just a surcingle that you can um, hook stirrups on. Yeah. I do intend to get her a proper saddle. Yeah. But I had this um, just for, you know, just for, for a sort of a, a start. She's eight years old and uh, starting her and backing her and things, it's, it's been a long process, not through her fault, just through me doing little bits here and there. Yeah. Um, I would say sitting on her was definitely the easiest bit. <laughs> she really didn't mind that at yeah. all. And she loves attention, all, all Eriskis do. Yeah. Um, they love their people, they love to be given a job to do because, again, originally, way back on the Crofts, on the Western Isles, they, they just sort of lived around the Crofts and would have seen their people every day. And when it was time to go and, and gather seaweed from the beach or pick up peats from where they'd all been cut and drying, they just, you know, caught up their pony and, and put the baskets on and, and set off. Um, so the ponies were so attached to, to each their, their own little family. Since Enya is still learning the basics of riding, and I'm only the third person that's ever ridden her, we took some time to get to know each other, practicing our walk to stop transitions and turns. This is a breed that I have read about in breed books, I've known about since I was a little kid, but to actually be here in Scotland for the first time and to be able to ride on an Eriskay pony is so, so much fun. <laughs> yes, it is. What is your favorite thing about the breed? I think it's just how they really get inside your head. They just take possession of your mind and then your heart, then your soul. You end up just living and thinking Eriski ponies.
Thank you all so much for riding along with me and discovering the Eriskay Pony. Make sure to watch out for the other Scottish horse breeds in the upcoming videos, and I'll see you all in the next episode. Thank you for the ride. <laughs> I love her. <laughs> Aww.